Hello everyone, this is Sharon here from 2470 again and we have the Redmi Note 9 Pro in front of us. So in this video what I will do is just set up the Redmi Note 9 Pro and show you a step by step guide on how you need to set up the Redmi Note 9 Pro so that the least number of ads are coming in and the phone is most enjoyable. So this is the Redmi Note 9 Pro and this is Indian retail unit out of the box and uh, this is exactly the same phone that you will get uh, right now. So yeah, glance for me. No. Turn system update off because I will update it whenever I want. Personalized ads. Switch off. I agree. What else can we do? Diagnostic data back. No. User experience program. No. Location. Okay. Yeah. And here is the list of apps. I really don't suggest you installing any of these apps. Select all so we if you select all then it will deselect it so that's nice to see next yep we do have a lot of app installed more apps so yeah a lot of bloatware is installed so we will go into the system app updater press settings and show notification no auto update don't update that's good so as you can see a lot of apps are here I would not like to install so many apps so I'll try to uninstall them or I will try to deactivate them so that's why I'm disabling system app update glance for me if I press cancel I don't think it's enabled yet yeah I don't think it's enabled so don't try to enable it the moment you enable it it will start showing up ads on the lock screen as well so yeah good that it's not enabled by default i think it's not enabled by default so hide notch so it's actually a bug because it's showing as a drop notch and it's actually a hole punch so yeah it's actually a bug it's actually taking the redmi note 8 pro's uh, drop notch so we are in notifications and I'll just tell you what all apps you should disable notifications for. So get apps, disable notifications. So all the system apps just disable notifications. Browser, I think security as well, not allowed. So we'll try to disable everything else in the security. You cannot disable notifications, but everything else we have tried to disable it. Browser, I have disabled it. Me video music me store so these are the apps you should disable notifications for so that you don't get random shitty notifications home screen you should disable app vault because it will show ads and i don't want to see ads we will go to full screen display and please enable gestures we will uninstall some apps i'll just show you what all we will uninstall hello we are me store will uninstall this vlog app this also just select everything and uh, whatever you don't like we'll drag it to uninstall what all gets uninstalled gets uninstalled what all doesn't get uninstalled we will leave it it will come back yeah so we'll just select everything because whatever apps i want i will install it one by one as per my liking i do not want apps to be installed like this So yeah, most of stuff has gone. Good to see that. That the things can be uninstalled. I wanted to show you guys that things can be uninstalled and that I'm not just ranting around that there is bloatware. There are a lot of apps, but it can be uninstalled. That's good to see. So yeah guys, thank you very much for watching. This was Sharon from 24-7 Techie showing you guys how to set up your latest Xiaomi phone on Mi UI 11 on Android 10. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. That helps us and that might help you also. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.